The shoulder is a complicated organ. Femoral, artery, lymph nodes, tendons, all those joints. If a bullet goes through you, there's also the clothing. Oh yeah, what did you think? I mean, if it's just this, then that's different. But if it's two layers of that, those are other impurities. The body does its job, just one function to release what cannot stay. He walked into the ER, smiled. I need a doctor, thanks man. Blood stops moving to the big towns. The brain is a big town. The heart is a big town. The kidneys are hot spots like Vegas, built to handle armies on vacation. The blood learns to bend another way like the legs of a crane. They make bullets different nowadays. In the good old days, a bullet went in and out and the holes matched. Now, a 22, a 38 expands in the body, absorbs like a tampon function, pull in all life. He was ordering drive through food, McDonald's food, not really food, maybe like French fries, maybe like a Sprite, maybe like a number two. Things that don't feel like food in the mornings down the street from my house, from his mama house, a clog. At the third counter, this guy has a gun. A gun has composition, has orchestration, is orchestral, is an organ of some complication, ephemeral. The bullets are small. A shoulder is innocuous until you become a nurse. The only reason he died was speed and proximity. But if it's a couple layers of cloth, well, you have to get that out too. Because you are not the admired nightingale. Because you are not the noble doe. Because you are not the picturesque ermine armadillo or bat. Because they have been written and I don't know their song the way I know you're scuttling between walls. 